Here's a few troubleshooting tips if your hydraulics aren't working. The first one is to check your battery. Make sure that all the wires and everything are connected tightly, but also double check that your battery has a full charge. One of the reasons people think there's something wrong with their pump is because their battery doesn't have a full charge and so it won't go up or down. Another area to check is the hydraulic fluid. If your fluid is too low, it can also result in your bed not raising or lowering properly. This unit has a dipstick, so you can check to see where the levels are at on there. Some of the reservoirs just have a line that indicates where the fluid level should be. Another area to check is the connections on your hoses, on both the hoses going to the reservoir, as well as the hoses going to the cylinder. No matter what type of hydraulic setup you have, whether it's dual piston, scissor lift, telescopic, hydraulic jacks, whatever, a good thing to check is the hydraulic lines. Make sure that they are not leaking and that uh, there's nowhere for fluid to escape or air to get into the lines. This can cause problems lifting and lowering as well. Another area to check is the connections inside the remote itself. Sometimes they don't connect quite properly, so there's just a few screws to undo and you can just check the contact points in there, make sure it's all lined up and your problem could be solved. If you have a newer Lamar dump trailer or a trailer with hydraulics, there's also a neat little troubleshooting guide under the lid in the toolbox. Now, if you don't have an awesome Lamar dump trailer like we'd recommend, and you still need this troubleshooting guys, you can find it on our website. Thanks for watching. For more hydraulic troubleshooting, check out our website, lamartrailers.com.